in Soviet country there was no opportunity for the artists to exhibit their work, like if the, this work was uh, uh, was political again and was uh, protesting the situation. And uh, in Soviet countries, especially in Russia, um, there we are this apartment exhibition which was very popular in from the 70s. So we like this idea um, to make exhibition in the apartment because uh, and the question where it, uh, the what is the private and what is the public space and where is the border between this public and private space and because um, in the uh, in one hand you uh, the public space so for example in Soviet period it was not a public space because it was uh, ruled by the government it was uh, their space not yours okay you can walk on the street but you can't uh, be like free and where, where you are more free because in Soviet period they uh, they uh, can do something in the private space and not in the public space and for now uh, every space public space is also occupied in uh, Georgia because it's privatized or it's also some of them are governmental and uh, to do something in the public space you have to um, to um, sign something or there, there is also some rules and what is the um, and this question what is the private and public and um, how we can make this public private space, public space, and uh, like with this question, just deal with this question. And we began to make this um, apartment exhibition and uh, um, to open the private space, most like uh, intimate in one hand uh, space and to make it, it a very public. And uh, also everything, uh, every galleries and so on, it's um, located in the centers. And we decided to move the centers uh, and to make it not in the center of Tbilisi, but in the other like part of the uh, city. And uh, the first uh, was Coca Takings Shower, and maybe I will speak about the other one, about the um, project which we did in Armenia. And it's also connected with the situation of neighbor, uh, what's going on in, uh, near the Georgia, because um, uh, it's uh, in the border of Azerbaijan and Armenia, and they have a war still, and they have it. Uh, um, so as Armenia have the territory with Azerbaijan, thinks it's, it's territory of there, and there is. In the border, there is a very nice, was a very nice city, but in Soviet period, and now it's destroyed. When we went to the city, everything was destroyed, and like there are this block of buildings, and we asked just one building for our work, and we just changed the pipe hole, the door, um, pipe hole, and uh, the visitors. It's a uh, twelve um, story. Yes, um, building, high building, and uh, in each floor there are four apartments, and we made the sign system. And with the sign system, you can see um, uh, who. Um, so there was a grid uh, rejected, uh, connection failed, and uh, uh, what else? And uh, that no one lives there. And you can find out that in this apartment, 16. Um, apartments were empty and you can understand from this work it was also some very social work because uh, you can see what's going on inside of the apartment because you can see that everything is destroyed even the entrance of this and uh, but uh, the apartments were very nice and cozy and very warm and very clean and so on and uh, you can see um, the thinking of uh, Soviet people when they you not know, taking care what's going on and out and, and where is the private and where is the public space but because the public space they don't care for the public space because this public space wasn't their space it's uh, governmental then they have to take care on it and not them and this first and the second one what's going on in this uh, country because all the people moved from uh, this area there is no job there is nothing to do in this uh, village because of this political situation because the economy situation and uh, with the, and uh, there was not elevator and you have to go like uh, uh, by the steps and um, okay and uh, um, so many problems which was shown by this work and the, the maybe the uh, 
one which we did in Azerbaijan. It was also very interesting because uh, there is one contemporary art center, Yarat, and, and very famous and very big, big, big money. And then invited us to open a public art festival in Azerbaijan. So it was a very uh, uh, strange situation because if you know the situation in Azerbaijan to make it public art and what is the public art and to open the public art festival uh, it's a um, because they have no any public space they have no anything where, where you can make something for example two years ago they made a performance they just take a paper there was nothing to uh, vote on this paper, just a paper, and they were taken to the police because they take this just a uh, uh, clean paper, and uh, uh, there uh, there are no independence anywhere uh, in Azerbaijan. And when they are inviting you to make to open the public, you have to be very critical for it. And of course, we did a uh, work very critical, but I was thinking they they didn't allow to do this work, and I write a text which was very ununderstandable. And then they wrote to make me it more clear, and then I again wrote something um, very strange. And they called to me and told what what you are doing. And then I have no chance, and I uh, opened what we want to do, and they uh, agreed to do it. And it was so strange. What we did, we um, asked one apartment and invited people on this apartment. And this apartment was gray color, and uh, there was uh, two days uh, openings in Azerbaijan. It's also very strange because in the first day they are inviting VIP people, like government people from the government, and the next day just for general people, <laughs> and uh, in the first day we um, colored uh, all the walls and uh, and everything uh, with the white color, but pushed them out from this space. And the next day we turned this gray color back. And the first day when this government came, they liked this work. We pushed them out from this place, but they like it. But the next day, when the uh, people came, they understood. They they we are asking why the gray color, why we are in like why the other region is the gray, and we tell uh, that we just turn back the color what it was before, and we also like pushed them out and um, and uh, the question was and uh, there was one guy who was. Before we have a lecture, and uh, he was a not uh, he was just an artist, not performance artist. He was just an artist, and he tried to change something. He stayed on the um, uh, on this space and uh, tried not to move. But then he began to move, and we paint him also in this space. If we stayed on this space, we uh, they will he left uh, something not colored, you know, and uh, the work was about when you don't um, try to change in your space, um, uh, it has changed uh, without you, and uh, you have to, uh, sometimes, uh, um, so I'm in this protest section, I am also like, but uh, sometimes I'm thinking that we can't change something, okay, we can protest, but we, we can, I think we can.